What's going on guys? Sticks here with the Token Minorities, and no, I did not forget about the Forbidden Light deck battles that, well, not Forbidden Light, but the new set deck battles that I always do with Aura, although admittedly we both forgot, what was it, what is this, two weeks after we said we were going to do we this? We didn't really forget, we were just busy. <laughs> Life is, yeah. like, Forbidden Light, like, this set always comes out, like, near the end of the semester, and for me That's it's, true. like, closer to when the Ramadan starts, and, like, everything is just a hectic mess. But yeah, we're here, guys. What's up? So, here. so what you're telling me is you can't wait to be Rama done with the dude, holiday? Dude, that's a good one. Uh, <laughs> I've never heard that one before. I think we just lost like 10 viewers at oh, least. Oh, that dislike, that, that dislike bar is just increasing. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so what we're doing is uh, Forbidden Light was actually a very good set in terms of the cards that it contributed to the meta. But we decided that with Malamar, isn't would you say Malamar is the most influential card from this set? I'd say B-String, honestly. B-String? Yeah. Well, either way, Malamar is the most influential Pokemon. How's that? How about that? Yeah, sounds good. Okay, so Malamar is the most influential Pokemon in this set. So uh, we're going to do a mirror match of Malamar right at the end, but in the first two games, we're just going to do some random decks. And uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and send that challenge over Orobomb's way. Y'all saw what I am bringing against him just to... <laughs> Casual item and supporter lock, the stuff that you would typically see in standard format. You know, you know, those things only bother you. <laughs> you're right. You're right. Like, you're to me, it's just like, oh boy, I get to play. It's like playing expanded, but in standard. <laughs> well, see, you're, you're actually a competitive player. I'm a for the lulls player. Uh, I, sure. <laughs> Let's go with that. Right, here it is. It's my favorite deck right now. Uh oh. It's, <laughs> it's going to be Pyro. It's going to be Pyro. Uh, no, it's not. I want to oh, play Pyro. There's, there's a grass type. I'm screwed. I, no. I have no chance. No, yeah. So it's it's my main attacker. To be honest, let's be real. Uh yeah, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. This is this is over. It's what all you, over. What are you playing? No, no. <laughs> the strats are ruined. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to redo this game. We're gonna have to redo it. We're gonna okay. Have to redo this game. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. I'm just kidding. Oh. oh okay. <laughs> I, was, I was legitimately about to forfeit. <laughs> No, I need you to know. I played Talonflame and two other basics, and I let up Diancy, which is unfortunate. <laughs> hmm, what do I do then? Uh, this is tough. Wait, what is... Oh, what is this? Is this one of the fossil decks? Yeah. Is it... It's Tyrantrum. Oh, cool. <clears throat> Tyrantrum's actually a lot of fun whenever you lead Talonflame. Wait, then, what's your, uh... What's your grass type? Celebi. Oh, uh, okay. Shining no. Celebi? Yeah. Yeah, that thing's... I, I really like that thing's artwork. It's really fun. Dude, I don't know if the Ultra Ball is the right play. I don't even know what I'm going to do here. Um, Let's drop you, because I have plenty of things to deal with that. We'll drop you. We'll see what I can do. We're dropping... Okay, we're dropping it tyrant. Hmm. Yeah, I actually have no idea what Tyrantrum what? does, all things cons like being completely honest. Oh, it's really fun. I can't wait what to does it do? You. Uh, let me see if I can. It's 100 damage, and you discard an energy. But it has the ability, which is really cool. It like gives you 60 more damage and 30 less, or 30, and you take 30 less damage. Oh wow! Wait, it gives 60 more, and your opponents do 30 less. Yeah. So it whatever. does. Oh, I guess you use uh, the tyr the tyrant crunch right yeah you just because it's a three energy attack so having access to crunch early is really really strong bro i'm yeah. done <laughs> this game, wait really this, this game is over for me oh <laughs> you have to redo the video sticks quick <laughs> <laughs> hey hey you you bodied me enough times let's see if my soul oh my dancy is there my dancy's there it's All over right. it's All over right. did you did you did you dock me am i dock i, oh, I didn't, I didn't Zygarde, quite dock yeah. i wish i did but not zygarde quite. zygarde Ooh, zygarde so valley that sounds cool yeah, it's actually really cool. I mean, it's not, like, the best, but, I mean, I actually kind of enjoy it. Sounds Make sure like you fun. can't use that. That's right. And all my, all my things are fossils, so... <laughs> 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 I can't use it anyways. And my Celebes prize and, like, just, just a bunch oh, of Oh, your right Celebes prize? Just a that bunch of bad. sucks. Oh, man. You know what's cool, though? Well, my fossils awesome. my fossils don't have weakness. <laughs> if I can ever find them. Yes. Got Wait, one. really? Yeah, because they're, they're, they're just they're items. <laughs> oh, that's right. Um, so Wait, this, this oh, so more. they're back. So they're back in that. Yeah. <clears throat> and you can max elixir awesome. onto them and everything. It's pretty cool. That's actually really awesome. All right, well, I guess... I don't want you to knock out Diancy. Here, take a fossil. 
But but I don't want a fossil. Oh, you can have a fossil. I don't want a fossil. You know, the video I recorded with this deck was, like, really, really successful. But uh, I got, like, I, I won all my games, but I got roasted in the comments because I forgot you could just discard fossils. Uh, which is important because you have to have less Pokemon in play than your opponent for Tyrantrum's ability to work. Oh, cool. And I was oh, like, you may discard this card from play. That's cool. Yeah, so you can just discard them whenever, which is really good. I was actually thinking about playing Secret Tech Guys. Here's a deck idea for the future. Fight alone Lucario with these fossils. <laughs> is, is it actually a Secret Tech, though? Sounds no, kind of bad. It's, it's not Secret Tech, so <laughs> good, but we can, we can pretend like it's a lot of fun. <laughs> so I actually get it now. That's cool. I get a prize off an item card. Not yeah, bad. Yeah, you do. That's it's not Robo Sub good, unfortunately. Yeah, Robo Sub. I hated that card with a passion. A lot of people did. Ooh, let's see if I can uh, pull some juice here. Nice. Oh, did you get the juice? You got the juice. Oh, um, he got the juice. That's not good. This is a little bit bad though, because you're gonna knock out Diancie, and there's not much yeah. I can do about it. So, yikes. Yeah, those are those are just dubs that we take. <laughs> I guess you can take the dub here. <laughs> what can right, I do? Let's go ahead and do this. Get rid of those guys. Yeah, if this if this doesn't go well, we can always I can always just use a. Uh, actually, I wasn't even intending this to be much of a competitive deck anyway. But I mean, this is a fossil deck. What can you expect? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I was not expecting that level of heat. Oh, to be honest. Oh, that's fun, bro. I, I, I've always liked fossils. They're just never good. Yeah. Which is sad. Well, fossils are fun. What was... All right, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to... Do you remember my Cradley Life Splosion deck? I do not. Oh, that was so bad, but it was hilarious. So what it was, was obviously the Cradley with Life Splosion. The more energy you had attached to it, search your deck for a stage two and put it on your bench. Dude, and so I, I am... ran it with, like... Vika Volt and uh, Decidueye and stuff like that. I am in a predicament. I think I have to Cynthia. I have Ultra Ball in my hand to get Tyrantrum, but I don't have many draw supporters left. But it's okay yeah. because we're pros out here. Well, so how much HP does uh, Tyrantrum have? 190? I guess you have to hit 160 to Okomi, which is easy enough, I guess. Yeah. Um, let me see. Is there anything else I can do here? I'm running dangerously low on. On draw supporters. Yeah. What does this thing do again? Sure, we'll get out of the deck. <laughs> like, this fossil excavation actually makes this deck pretty cool. Because now you have, like, so much access to your fossils now. Search your deck for an unidentified fossil. Put it in your hand. Oh, cool. So it's literally just from either the discard pile or wherever. Yep. Oh, well, there's the damage. Oh, yeah, it, it hits for a lot. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Shoot, I might, I might actually lose this. Because <laughs> Silvalli so is I mean, I'm, gonna take, I'm probably going to take four prizes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Silvalli so is just kind of trash. So Tyrandrum such an efficient attacker if you can get the three energies on there. I, I guess that's kind of counter and counter... Uh, intuitive, huh? Um, yeah. It's cool because you can use Shining Selby and use Tyrant's attack. And Tyrant's one yeah. energy attack adds up so much with your ability and strong energy and choice, man. Like, for one energy, if you have strong energy attached, right, and you have your ability active, you're hitting for 20 plus 20, that's 40, plus 60, that's 100, plus Dianti, that's 120. Um, plus choice band, that's 150. You can hit 150 for a single energy with Tyrant. Holy crap. And, that, and then you have, you, as long as you have Tyrant's ability active. So it's pretty strong. And this is why I run Baby Buzzwool. Oh, God. Well, GG, boys. <laughs> GG, boys. I was about to just get trashed. There's, and nothing, there's absolutely nothing I could do now. <laughs> very glad that I decided to play that strong energy. I completely forgot about Tyrantrum's ability, and I was like, yeah, you know what? I'll just play the strong energy just because, but nope. It, it, wow. Okay. Ouch. <laughs> there's actually nothing I can do. <laughs> Wait, really? Yeah, like, I have Max Luxor in my hand, a couple energies, but I have to lose them. To, to uh, Sycamore. So, like, and I have to get my more of my unidentified fossils or my fossil excavation because my fossils are prized. My other fossils prized. Your fossils are prized. Oh, my wow. My unidentified fossils prized, yeah. That sucks. So, I have to get the excavation map, which I don't have. So, GG. Oh. Hold on, we're going to go out like a champ. Hold on. Uh, go on. Going out like a champ? Yeah, hold on. Uh, okay, hold on. I'm going to be 
Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Going out on your own terms, it's like right. wishy washy versus lichen rock. Dude, that sucks. When you don't lead when you don't lead Tile Flame, that's like really bad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Time so to cut I, the ante. <laughs> I mean, I was, I was trying to bring a fun team. I wasn't expecting that level of heat. <laughs> it's all good, bro. Uh, we can play the next game. Okay. Um, next game, what do we got? Uh, oh, I know what, what do I'm I have? Playing. Where is... Hmm. You know what? I actually don't think I've tried this <clears throat> team yet. Or this team. Wow, I've been playing too much uh, real Pokemon. Oh, yeah. Uh, real Pokemon? Used... Wow. Yeah. What a loser. Real Pokemon. Who plays real Pokemon anymore? <laughs> <laughs> dude I, I got i got addicted to the draft format it happened it's so much fun i want to play it but like i don't have time i don't yeah. have time to work with other people <laughs> yeah I, I i don't like other people other people are the worst except for the people <laughs> that watch this video i love you guys yeah you guys are all the best don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe <laughs> <laughs> shameless plugs from aura <laughs> okay yes. Ooh. Yes. okay this hand is pretty mediocre but yes Let's go for it. Um, Mediocre. That sounds like my life. Oh, ho, ho. all right. We're playing some some fun rainbow heat. Oh ho ho. Oh, not I... it. Hold on, I can yeah, use I'm... that. I can use that. Actually, that's pretty useful. I'm gonna get trashed. Have you seen? Oh, I'm gonna get. Okay, all right. The Pokemon that can Oko me for three energies, but it's fine. <laughs> Oh, I actually can. What do you know? <laughs> cool. I'm going to get trash. All right, all right, guys. Styx is out here. He's counter decking. Uh, <laughs> Don't listen I'm, to Styx. He, he took out my Talon Flames from my deck before we could start. So <laughs> I hack TCGO. It's what I do. It's what he does. You heard it here first. Um, let's do this. Let's do this. I actually don't think I run any Max Elixirs. So that's unfortunate. Ooh, Faramosa. Yeah. Was that Faramosa? I think it was it Faramosa. Is. Yeah, it was. Um, let's do this, this. Interesting. And Cynthia. Yeah, it's like I, this deck This deck can hit 210 with relative ease, and you can use a bunch of like free retreat mons that can actually attack as well. So that's I like this deck awesome. a lot. That's kind of awesome. I think we'll just pass it up here. Don't uh don't set up that uh Duskman over there. <laughs> Ooh, don't have uh don't have a full bench of Ultra Beasts, please. Cause like I said, I don't think I'm gonna lose this. <laughs> Alright, don't All right, do it. Let's see if I can Don't do it. And let's pull Because if you do, that's gonna be bad. <laughs> what is this? What is this blower? I don't need that card anymore, we're all good. Yeah. Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> I had. Ah, uh, oh, I just missed it. Yes. Just missed yes. it. Yes. That sucks. Do I have enough to knock you out? Uh, One, two, three, four, five. I think I'm good. Oh, you need Arceus Prism down still. Hmm. Let's go ahead and. Oh, oh, you play Arceus Prism. Yeah, that's why this deck's cool because you can easily get uh, the Water Grass Lightning, and then you can just charge up all your Xerneas. That's awesome. It was just a reason for me to play Diantha and Arceus yeah. Prism. Man, if I just drew one of my other three Ultra Spaces, I would have been able to knock you out this turn. Ooh, clever. But you didn't. <sighs> and that means I am potentially going to get a knockout if I can draw what yeah. I need. Nice. I actually... Assuming it's not prized, don't be prized, don't be prized. It's prized. Um, <laughs> well, looks like we oh. are resorting to a worst-case scenario. <laughs> 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 I do love Tapu Lele's. I need to get me a experience share. Oh, you're the worst. No, I don't have it. One. Do I take a knockout? One, two, three, four. Whatever. Garbage. Um. Yeah, you should. I think I, I feel do. Like I'm, you I'm not gonna do math. I'm just gonna attack and hope for the best. Yeah, I mean, like nobody. Oh, did, does. oh crap. Oh. I actually thought I did it. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I have. I don't even have choice band. Never mind. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, I got rid of your choice band. You had a choice, man. You just played it onto the one on the bench. Oh, did I? Oh, well, well yikes. That's what I get for not wanting to do math. <laughs> I literally just said, not going to do it. Don't care. <laughs> I forgot this deck is meant to knock out Buzzwalls and then Zorix with choice band. I forgot about that. <laughs> and do that. It's too yeah, early I mean, nobody, anyway, actually, I nobody actually plays Nagan Adele. It's bad. You're right. And then let's do this. And then, ooh, ooh, I like that. But it hmm. looks like I'm... Doesn't, I don't think I'm going to be able to keep it because it sounds like Aura is going to end me out of a good hand. Absolutely not. Unless I top deck. I already lost my only Lele. 
<laughs> then he's just gonna Coco for the knockout. That's pretty heat. It's pretty heat. I'm, I can get behind that. Oh, I like Arceus Prism, but then I would need another Coco afterwards as well. What does Arceus Prism do? Uh, thirty damage and attach three energies from your deck to your board. <laughs> What? Yeah, how many energies is that? I mean, how many energies does it cost? It's one energy. That's busted. Yeah, what the good, heck? It's a good card. Um, no, it's not. It's a broken card. Well, I mean, you need three specific types on the board to make it work. Oh. Gotcha. <laughs> Less busted, but still. Mm. And didn't get it. That's a, that's a dang oh, shame. Okay, let's right. go ahead and put... No beast strings, all right? <laughs> so I'm put this active. Um, let's. I don't want to do this. Let's do this. Grab another Naga. Dude, my Selvi was prized last game, and now my Naga's my Arceus is prized this game. <laughs> Dude, it's oh, a good time. To, it's a good time to be Orbom. That's that's just not fun. You know what else is not fun? Uh, you doing everything that you're doing right now. It's not a good time. <laughs> Well, do you want to do you want to have even less fun with it? No, uh, I'm good. <laughs> I think, I think I I'm think trying to have I a good time here. I think you do want that to. Happen. I mean, you're gonna knock me out. I don't think that matters. <laughs> um, let's do. Yeah, you know what? I feel like doing this. So, and then let's let's just go ahead and end this game before it can start. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh yeah. I don't see how that matters. <laughs> There's no energy on it. <laughs> just get rid of just get rid of Zerni Eye. You're right. Genius plays by sticks. Oh yeah. And also the, getting rid of your DCE. Part of nice. the token minority. Um what do I do here? I'm the whitest person on earth and I am part of the token minorities. Just let the irony of that situation sink in. I guess I hope you don't have another Guzma. That seems to be a decent play. <laughs> You're not and wrong. Then, uh, huh? Got a Fey Ray. Let's take a look here. What do I got? What do I have to deal with this situation? Man, why is this? Okay, I why think is I have Naga's plenty of draw supporters? So I should be able to do this and get away with it. Are you doing any? Okay. Yeah. Please I'm all for to a goose. Well, I would so. laugh. <clears throat> That'd be annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. Uh, let's do this. And pass. Let's pass. Pass through. Unfortunate. Alright, well, let's go ahead and grab this. I mean, luckily, you're taking only one prize at a time. Yeah, I know. For the most that's, part. That's the annoying thing about it. Um, and then Naka is. And now I don't need choice banner yet, so that's pretty useful. Yeah, so let's. I don't want to do this. Is any Pokemon in the game resist fairy yet? Huh? Do any Pokemon in the game resist fairy yet? I don't think so. I don't think so either. It's kind of like. Let's I just don't get do it. this. And how come fairy types don't resist dragon? Um, they all resist because dark. You think they'd make a mix dark, or something? <laughs> just they resist both. Just make fairy even more OP. Pretty much. Right, really, I feel now, like fairy. This time I have to get. Uh, experience shares Xerneas. You know, I play these cards to draw them. <laughs> oh my god, what a pain. Dude, dude, nobody draws cards anymore. You're like, right. That's just not a thing that happens. You're absolutely right. What is the... I don't have Xerneas. I, don't, I mean, I don't have... Um, what's it called? Man, I don't have anything. This is kind of lame. Let's drop... How many fairies do I have left? I have quite a few. We'll drop quite a few. on you. Go ahead and just drop that. Xerneas. I don't know, man. I have to, like... I don't know how I'm going to win this. It's okay. I don't know either, because if we just keep going at this pace, you're going to win. I mean, I, I could have potentially won if I had experience share. I played three of them, and I'm already over halfway through my deck. That's a, that's a dang shame. Um, I'm, d I'm debating if it's smarter for me to attack now or... For me to wait till I get experience here. But, like, you have a lot of cards in your hand, so I don't think that's the best idea. I'm just going to attack now. Yeah, I would, I would definitely say that that's the better option. Let's see if I can get uh, um, Arceus. Uh, Nothing. I would need... If I get Arceus, what does that actually do for me? I don't know. Let's do this. Um, 
Oh, we need to get another N. Which I've lost three already, so never mind. And then one and one and one. Let's do that. I think I'm gonna have to try to pull something somewhat cheeky. Maybe. Let's see if I can do this. And let's get rid of that and that. I, I really just don't like my own ultra spaces. <laughs> I do it all the time with Brooklets. Just to and reuse my Brooklets every turn. Let's just pray. Yeah, okay, let's Claw Slash. That's fine. And... Do we get anything we can use? Eh, yeah, good enough. Mm, let's go into you. Okay, now I just need... Yikes. A Guzma. Yeah. Okay, you didn't get anything? Yeah. Unfortunate. So I can't attack just yet. Wait, did I actually end you into something you can't use? What? Yeah. That's like unheard of for me. Um, let's do this. And then Psychomore. And there we go. Okay, so I think, think this might be Jeej at this point. Yeah, I think it's over. I mean, it was over the second I didn't draw anything off that. Yeah. If I just got into energy, I would have been alright, but it's all it's all good. It's all downhill from here. Oh, I forgot you actually resist. Mm-hmm. And there we go. And just discard all of those. And there's a prize. Oh, shoot, I still have my GX attack. Cool. Curtana yeah, might it. actually do something. Oh, you're right. Um... <laughs> Uh oh, Faramosa. Faramosa's coming up. Well, I guess, oh, you have to have. If you only have one press card, okay. Trying to hit trying to hit the lotto. I'm just trying to get a single energy card. Hey, there you go. <laughs> yeah, I just. I, I got lucky in this one. I will completely admit that I got lucky. It's all good. Doesn't really matter. Uh, let's but, toss away you and you. Yeah, I was the reason I played down the poi pole was because what I was thinking that I ended up would end up having to do was attack with Carcana into a Xerneas, then force you to take one prize. So Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, this game's done. <laughs> so, Alright, there you go. How many DCs do I left? I have one DC left. And you uh, can just, GX. just do this. Yeah, there you go. Oh yeah. Yeah, Vulcanian come up to uh That's right, guys. Guys, if you guys want to see Sticks lose more often, go watch every single other one oh, of these I was, best I was of three. I was just about to say that. I was about, like, I think every this single is, best other these, best of three. Where I you're... think it took me. <laughs> I think I've won more oh, in this than the last like three videos we've done together combined. <laughs> you're not wrong. All right, let's do the Armalmar video. <laughs> Almar. All right. So yeah, I know you, ours are usually like. Uh, couple or, or an hour at least but in this case we're both well you know dying uh oh yeah i gotta get to work in like 30 minutes so oh shoot that. yeah he's Dude, he's around the done with everything that's going on right now and i'm just <laughs> Dude, it's, too, it's too early in the morning it's it, it's usually closer to like five o'clock am i just like don't speak to me <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't, wait didn't you have food before the sun came up yeah okay so you're still good for now Ooh. All right, we're going to start this game real quick, and I have to go respond to my mother. So I'm going to mute for a couple seconds. I'll be right back. Okay. Bar is leaving. He's he's super professional, guys. Uh, that's just that's just how it goes. Uh, <laughs> but we lose the coin flip, so he is going to be able to go first. And I hope you enjoy listening to the sound of my lovely voice because, oh, my gosh, I am screwed. But anyway, we just kind of... Yeah, so there's that, and it's 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 not going to be good. Uh, for those of you on Aura's channel, you right, can see on. how. Okay. I'm gonna quickly finish my turn, and then I gotta go run and take the trash out before the trash dude decides to ditch us. <laughs> Boom, that a boy. You. There you are. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm just I'm I'm kind of screwed at this point. Yeah, dude, I'm not. I, I don't have the best hand either. I had the worst start possible for this deck. You know, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna 
It's gonna go for it. Just going for it. He's okay, go do for it. For just get, gonna... discard it. Discard everything. That didn't actually uh, work out very well. <laughs> that did. Uh, yeah. That did the opposite of work out well. Um, <laughs> I definitely don't need you oh. in this matchup, so we'll toss you. Uh, oh yeah, I run the Marsh Shadow too. It's fun. What are you talking about? I think you should definitely run Marsh Shadow against a Psychic deck. You're right. <laughs> the best case scenario. Let's see. Is there anything else I really can do? Not really. Whatever. We'll just so make this do. matchup is literally just going to come down to who gets set up first. That's that's the mirrors. All right, I'll be right back. Now I got to take out the trash okay. real quick. All right, go take out your trash. Because. And wow. Okay. Um, I'm probably just going to get absolutely trashed in this because I have. I have nothing. I have absolutely nothing. I think Aura was expecting me to take a little bit longer on the turn, and I really hope that the timer doesn't run down on him because actually that was yeah a little little missed foresight on my part. Just kind of you know not playing anything or just playing everything down quickly because I'm used to the used to the quick plays. So Aura is about to go take out the trash, and I'm. Well, I mean, he, when he comes back, he's going to take out the trash that is me because what I have right now is uh, this complete and utter garbage. Um, so this is this is looking very bad very quickly. I mean, if I had two Inke, then this would be phenomenal because then I could play down that my I could evolve both my Malamars next turn. But just the fact that I have these in my hand uh i mean i or bomb's gone so he can i can go ahead and tell you guys what's in my hand i have two malamar a field blower and an energy which really not useful at all i don't have supporters i don't have much of anything in fact i probably should have even just end as that would have allowed me to at least shuffle the stuff back into my deck but then again at the same time i wanted to have the energy I wanted to have the energy in the discard pile. That way, they could be active once the they could be active once my Malamars got set up. If my Malamars ever do get set up, I mean, it's there's a real possibility that I just don't get anything set up at this point. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, this is Aura might just do what he usually does in these videos and absolutely uh, trash me or wipe the floor with me, whichever whichever uh, description you prefer. But yeah, at this point, I'm just uh, buying time until Orbomb gets back. There's really not a whole lot to talk about. I mean, he has an Inke, a Narangru, and a Dark. Right. Okay, I, I was just uh, rambling. Returned. I got nothing. Oh, you're playing the Cross? Ooh, clean. I mean, I mean, the the ooh is a little bit uh, just kind of unnecessary as it's not going to amount to anything. <laughs> you're right. Because, yeah, would you want to hear what my hand is right now? Tell me. Two Malamar, a Field Blower, and an Energy. Let's see, if you're playing this, I can knock everything out with this Pokemon, so... Yeah, I know you easier. can. This is not good. <laughs> Let's see. I'll grab Sycamore, and we'll see if I can... Actually, I'll grab Cynthia. I already lost. If you guys can hear my mother in the background, I do apologize. She's being very loud right now. What's she yelling at you for this time? Um, she's yelling at something. <laughs> I generally just choose to ignore it. Oh, <laughs> uh, I just drew a psychic energy. I was considering drawing sick more, just in case I can throw oh. away more psychics. Oh my gosh, you're the worst. It's okay, I think I'm literally just going to be attaching and passing and then dying as soon as you get a Guzma. I do apologize. Um, like, <laughs> like the second you get a Guzma, I, I pretty much just lose. I would need a float stone, honestly. No, you don't. Well, I can't retreat. No, you just Guzma up my Necrozma, go into Lele, and then invade. That's true, but I can Oko you with a Dark Flash if I get a Choice Band as well. You can Oko... Oh, yeah, because you have the Beast Energy. Hmm. But, but I mean, wouldn't you rather knock out an attacker as opposed to Lele? I mean, the attackers can go whenever they... whenever Because they, they're, they're non-threatening attackers right now. <laughs> well, just kind of fair, there. there's literally there's literally nothing threatening on my board. <laughs> yeah, so like right now it's just like, eh, who cares? <laughs> um, yeah, that's that's fair. I have so many energies in this card pile. I'm pretty set. I just need to get an attacker. So ideally, I draw another Dawn Wings 
in another mall. Mark. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Check check out this play. Check out this play. Boom. What about this? Ha. Yeah. Take that. Oh boy. Um. <laughs> well, yeah. I lost all my field bowlers, so that's there to stay. Stay. Did, didn't expect that coming, did you? Nope. You got me there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Guys, that's gonna be my one win for this game. Hmm. Okay, low key. This is they very did, awkward. They did a good job on the reverse hollow of uh, Parallel City. That looks kind of cool. They did. It looks very nice. Huh. You know what they didn't do a good job on though? Tell me. The, the rainbow rares. Ooh, got them. If, if only somebody had told you from the beginning that rainbow rares did not look good when reported. It's not. It, I mean, you never told me that. Those people, you just said you didn't like them. <laughs> I also said you can't tell what they are. I mean, that's true, but. I never plan on doing live recordings. This is all for personal. And then I started doing more live recordings, and everyone's just like, eh. I'm like, eh, Oh, yeah, I mean, right. you kind of exploded for the live recordings. What are you up to now? Like, 4.5? Something like that. Nice. No, that's not That's not even close, actually. Now that I actually heard you. <laughs> now I'm at oh. 3.7, I think. Yeah, that's close. That's actually... I mean, if you, keep do, if you keep doing what you're doing, you'll definitely hit that very soon, because people are starting to like that more and more. So, this is a tough turn, right? I have to stay active so you can't Guzma me. So, I can't switch. Implying that I have anything going at all. Yeah, but you could just top deck a Guzma and an energy card and then take a knockout. <laughs> so, like... You know, I, I wish Black Ray GX hit for weakness. Dude, that'd be stupid. <laughs> it's not It's not. It's not go overboard. Uh... Okay. <laughs> well, I feel bad. That's okay. You got the Guzma. Yep. Yeah. All right. GG, guys. GG. <laughs> All right. I, 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 I feel bad, but I really shouldn't after those other games. <laughs> Let's just uh, invade here. I mean, at and, least you uh, got something going in those other games. You got to attack with Tyrantrum. I'm just sitting here. You're right. You're like, right. Uh, no, you're right. Yeah, you're not wrong. At least the games were oh, something. Boy. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> oh man, this is. How are you? It, hmm? it it baffles me every time I play this deck and I get stuck, because I'm just like I play eight ball search, <laughs> and a very high count of supporters. How every time I play this deck, I'm just like, what 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 do I do? What am I doing wrong? There's nothing I'm doing wrong. Uh -huh. It's just Pokemon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> so what is your hand again? Two Malamar and a field blower. Damn, that sucks. <laughs> oh man, <laughs> that's not fair. That's oh, not just, fair. Oh, this God. isn't even a game. <laughs> Stop it. Why? Stop I'm, just, it. I'm just setting up, bro. You said whoever sets up first wins. <laughs> By set up, I mean even just attached energy to an attacker. You're right. That's what I did. <laughs> you even got a Ranguru going. <laughs> just in case, backup attacker, you know. Oh man! You know what's oh, really man. annoying though. I'm not, I'm gonna say that the most annoying part of this new meta is this Dawn Wings. Mm. It's so hard to find like a dark attacker that isn't Zoark to yeah. actually deal with this Pokemon. Like I I resorted to like playing a uh, the Evil Admonition Weavile in like a bunch of my decks, a bunch of my fighting decks because of the unit energy. Really? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Dude, give me a choice ban off this so I just win. I have. Are you serious? Sorry, man. Oh I believe in you. God. Oh my oh. god. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, I don't run Inkays in this deck. I probably should check that. You're right. Oh my god. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. There you go. <laughs> that. That was the unluckiest you wanna, and luckiest uh, game at the wanna, same time. You want to do a rematch? I mean, do you, do you it's have pretty, to? It's a pretty short video. We have, I have time. Okay, you got time. Okay, yeah, let's do a let's rematch. Do a rematch. <laughs> that was just me drawing my initial hand and being like, "Well, okay, this is fun. I enjoyed it." Actually, you know what? Screw that. Um, let's see. Eh, you know what? If he wants to, if he wants to just beat me with Dawn Wings again, he can. I mean, that's the that's the issue I have with the decks. Well, I mean, it's just a mirror match, right? But, like, Ultra Necrozma has a stronger mirror match because you're not playing Necrozma. 
Yeah. That's why I mean, like, I hear a lot of people, guys. Guys, let me know. Here's a common question day, right? If you guys coming from my video, if you answer a common question day, you have a chance to win a couple of codes, like the huge. But um, common question day, which one do you guys prefer, Necrozma Malamar or Ultra Necrozma Malamar? I've been hearing a huge mixture of both. I know that the Mexico special, oh my god, <laughs> the Mexico special uh, had Necrozma Malamar. Uh, as the winner, but it's like a 56 person tournament, so it's a, the equivalent of a of a uh, League Cup While the alternate cross with Malamar had a bunch of good placements. Hold on guys <laughs> So basically what I think or is saying is that he he thought that alternate cross with Malamar had high had better placings considering the size of the tournament like it's better to place it's better to place uh, lower in a larger tournament than high in a very small tournament. So honestly, if, if it's like if you're asking my opinion, I think that Necrozma Malamar has a little bit better of a situation overall. Uh, just regular Necrozma Malamar at that, uh, just because I think that it handles well. In particular, Buzzwell, which got insanely strong with the new <clears throat> Forbidden Light set but also the fact that you don't have to rely on medals. And I know that that's kind of a, that's something that you can work around by running a higher metal count, but then you clog up the deck a little bit. And I don't you're, know, I'm you're just- right. No, you're, you're I'm right though. I'm just one that's all for consistency. Like, I mean, or you know me, you know that I am ridiculously paranoid about energies and not being able to draw them when I need them. See, the reason so, why I like alternate cross with Malmar is because as far as harder. like Buzzwell decks, like Psychic Week decks, you have more than enough energies to work with a deck that only that that can just win the game by using Dawn Wings alone, and then you have Ultra Necrozma, which just helps a lot more against um, against like Zoark matchups. No, I completely agree. I I can definitely agree with that. I, I can't draw more. All right. Uh, you can't oko me. Is there? You went first, right? No, you can't blow me away. Um, you know. No, I didn't. No, you, you went go first. first. No. Oh, crap. Dude, you play down a lot of cards. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's a nice opening hand. <laughs> I know. After what I had last game, it's about dang time. Let's see. Let me throw you down here. And, um, yeah, you can't, you can't blow me away. All right. No, I can't. No. Um, okay. Get rid of both of those for... But, yeah. So, like, I don't know, man. Oh, like alternate cross and Malmar had a lot of good placements in the 156 number special. I don't remember where it was, but all I know is that 156 players went, and there was like a good a good percentage of it was alternate cross and Malmar with a bunch of different like variants, which was really cool. A lot of them were playing Max Luxer, which is something I want to play around with because it seems interesting. I like this for the mirror, but like at the same time, uh. <laughs> no, I, I definitely agree. Like I can definitely get behind that logic and i see exactly where you're coming from in fact when you were gone i was explaining that what you were saying was it's better to place a little bit lower <clears throat> in a larger tournament than high at a small tournament so yeah, yeah i mean i definitely agree that ultra necrozma i mean it hits harder for less energy and it has all the tools but it's Man, just a matter more. of having consistent access to those tools when you need them particularly the metal energy because you're running a relatively low count and you're susceptible to either having like to discard them early or having them prized that type of thing yeah then you have backup attackers yeah my uh my new list oh thank god my new list is playing uh a clefairy <laughs> from uh i think it was evolutions like for oh three my god you can copy your opponent That's... back no way it's so funny <laughs> uh, <laughs> every time awesome. it works it's like ha. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I don't know what to do here because that's sort of what it was a pain. Um, hmm, what else can I do? Retreat can Marshadow can Marshadow take any knockouts this game? Maybe. Probably. If you knock me out here, I can maybe do it. But I have to take a knockout here, so boom. Okay, now let's see if I actually get what I need to not just lose, which is very unlikely because it's me, and we all know this. <laughs> there we go. Where are my How many Guzmans did I drop so far? Just one. All right, good. Oh, you are playing the elixirs. I like the elixirs. It makes you a little bit more aggressive. Yeah, um, I, de I definitely like the elixirs. Let's do 
that. And then Lele for, I would say, like N. N served me well so far in this live, so I mean, I figure oh, it's might as well shame. go for it. Actually, no, it, it didn't last game. It just gave you the choice band immediately. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I had Dawn Wings in hand, though, so I guess it's doing oh, a little bit more for you this game. Oh, that's fantastic, but awful at the same time. you got to be kidding me. Oh, that's a lot of mollas. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's also what also sucks about this? You can't retreat. I have no energy. <laughs> yeah, see, this is what I mean. I run a deck of ten to eleven energy, and I still don't draw into it when I go through half my deck. So if I had that, then I'm pretty sure I just kind of like I was pretty sure that I had a really you're, good you're chance going to just places win. if you had yeah. A... Because then I had the three Malamars. It doesn't really change much, though, unless I, like, get Guzma off this Orangaroo. Well, I mean, all you need is just a Psychic Energy, and you knock out my Malamar. That's true. At the very least, that's something. Uh, sure. Let's... Let's just... How many... Actually, I should probably be more safe. Um... Hmm. Let's drop you two. And let's take a look. All right, we're good there. All right. So, get, <laughs> that's such a sticks thing, to get three Malamars only to not be able to... Oh, I can't use this. Ooh. <laughs> I just drew Beast Energy, and I can't really use it. Um, yeah, so, you can. I mean, I could, but I'm not getting a knockout with it. Okay. Hmm. Right, come on. Give me a frickin' energy! <laughs> How many oh, I are this gone? Game. All right, that shouldn't be too bad. Or this is a bad game. I mean, it is for both of us. <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon is not a fun All game. Right, there we go. Huh. Yeah, with my energy, so it's all good. Uh, okay. Well, I'm okay. I'm okay with that. Um, that. And then, mysterious treasure, <clears throat> I guess. Eh, whatever. Really didn't matter. And, yeah, let's do this. Oh, so, you don't like Pseudo Wudo. You're going to hate this. That doesn't really fix any issues, or... Make it any worse. I can just drop Lele. Is the baby? Yeah. Do I drop Lele? Yeah, I just drop Lele. I can attack with Actually, my it might, if you have a field blower, it might actually give you another. Yeah, it gives me more bench space. Yeah. So I can actually bench two things instead of just one, which is kind of handy. Um, um, let's do this. Psychic recharge onto. Actually, wait. Can I knock out anything? Yeah, just and you can load up like a bunch of Lele's. You can just load up a bunch of Lele and take a bunch of Nuggets at some point. Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, let's just go ahead and do that. And did I calc wrong? No, I didn't. I don't think. Oh, no, just enough. I was like, wait, did I, did I do this wrong? <laughs> <laughs> Which, to be fair, wouldn't be too far out of the ordinary for me. All right, let's see if we can get something out of this. Um, uh, I guess that's something. I can drop you... And drop you. Can get rid of that and that, but it's fine. I need to draw something. Come on, what ain't good? Mm, I mean, it's not the best, but at least it's a, another <laughs> game on the board. Yeah. Okay. Is he gonna? Are you gonna be able to knock me out? No. Ah. Uh. Shame. I'll pass it up. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is gonna be funny. Wait. You just Guzma and I can take a knockout if that's what you're talking about. No, this will be hilarious if I can pull this off. Okay, if I can actually pull this off, I will laugh really hard. Please, please, please. I don't know. Yes. I have no idea what you're talking about. 
Um, actually, I wait. I can't even retreat anyway. So there's that. Um, but because if I oh, can... are you gonna try to knock out Inke with Lele? No, I was gonna try to. Oh yeah, Orangri with Lele. Oh yeah, you would need six energies. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what I've. So you're gonna just straight up give yourself six energies? Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna let you know right now. I am never knocking out that Lele. <laughs> um, now is a good time to lose Marshadow. And then I don't think I'll be able to retreat though, so you'll still be able to knock me out. Yeah, and if I get Choice Man, I take a knockout as well on Lele, if I need to. But I'm gonna try my best to not take a knockout on it. <laughs> Why? Because <laughs> I want you to keep oh, those yeah. energies forever. That's fair. Let's take that. And then all he has to do is just Guzma up my Necrozma, take two prizes. Hmm. Oh. You're right, that's all I have to do, but this is just a better card in this matchup. Um, oh, I don't have a Ranger anymore. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, you can just easily... You can easily take two prizes off of my... Actually, yeah, I think you win now. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I win. Because you can knock out Lele and then Psychic Recharge easily. Yeah. Knocks out my Necrozma. And I have choice bands, so I don't even need yeah. to GX. Although I yeah. can't, I can't G can I GX? I can GX if I need to. Actually, I probably will GX, because why not? I'm not going to use any other GX deck this game. Yeah. Yep, GG. GG only. Yeah, this is, I mean, like, obviously this has the much better mirror match. Yes. Mirror match. But I, I think, I think um, like, for a meta call, like, unless the meta is completely this deck... Uh, then I think that as like as a meta call, I, I think... disagree. I think I think this one's better. I mean, like, so there's an the argument that you can just GX into Espeon. Uh, mm -hmm. That's my that's one argument. Like, I kind of don't like. So so my mentality is that like mm -hmm. you're you're setting you know up uh, like you can knock me out anyway. But I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do this just because you're right because it's cool. <laughs> I mean, you could oh. GX me this turn. I mean, it doesn't matter. I, I wouldn't be. I don't have Guzma, so I wouldn't be able to knock you out this upcoming turn, which does give you a chance to win. How? Because then you just take a knockout next turn and win the game. But you GX me with your Marshadow using Dawnwings GX. Do I have? Yeah, you have Dawnwings down there. Oh shoot, I do. So there you go. Okay. There you go, guys. Uh, aura lessons. <laughs> yeah, how do you know? Horror bomb actually does do something radicationally. Huh? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> huh? <laughs> I'm just being real. He's a better player. I'm just. That's just not nice, throw. dude. Don't, don't look. Okay, guys. So I was actually, you know, what? I'm not gonna get into this conversation. But like, people like sticks. Like sticks is like a huge reason why I play the game. So like, I don't really ever look at anybody like that as superior or inferior to anyone. Oh, oh shoot! Resistance. You resist. I forgot. <laughs> No, that's my fault. But you know, you need choice, man. That's not my fault. You should have thought about yeah. that. <laughs> um, Dude, I, I wouldn't even have made that play if you didn't point that out. I was just going to accept the L. Actually, I should have just brought up a Malamar, because then I could knock out uh, Dawn Wings next turn. Oh, you know, and, that's what but, you should have done. Yeah, oh well. I mean, See, I'm going to be happened. honest. I had Lele to get Guzma, if you did take a knockout. Um, but that was your best chance to win the game, I think. Yeah. Um, I think I'm just going to... Retreat into you and just set it up again. Pure safety. That way there's at yeah. least one attack already. Yeah, so I mean, you do have. I mean, you have the Lele for the Guzma, so I mean, it's just kind of. I mean, it doesn't matter. Oh. You're at a GX, so yeah. at this point I can just knock out anything that comes up. Well, any two prize attacker that comes up. Yeah, I mean, my plan is to Malamar, but I mean, if you have the. If you have the uh, for the Guzma, then that's just. You can enemy this turn. <laughs> Enemy to two, and uh, I mean, I have two Dawnwings ready, so that's that's all I'm saying. Like, it's it's. I don't think it's gonna happen, unless it could. Uh, could it happen? Kind of. Uh, I don't know. It's tough. It's a tough call. If you end me, yeah. knock out the Malamar. With Malamar, yeah. If you end me and knock out the Malamar with the Malamar, I have to whiff Guzma completely, and then you can win. Well, I mean, no time like the present. 
Let's see if D Drot. That's why I don't know you. <laughs> yeah, you got it. I did, All right, I did not. I did not. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that's something. You know what that means, right? Top decks? I'm gonna have to you got hope. the top deck? I'm going to have to hope you don't have it either. <laughs> <laughs> you already GX, so you can't knock out my Dawnwings from the bench. Yeah. Um, I think you just should just leave oh, this active. I think I have it. I think it's got Guzma. it. I, it's, it's, if I have Guzma on the deck, I yeah. think I do. Um, yeah, I got it. All right, GG, dude. That was GG. a good one. There we go. All right, see, I'm, I'm good. Dude, I've been playing this deck. For a long time, ever since this I started the... doing, ever since I started doing the uh, live deck matches for Forbidden, like a month before release, I've been playing this deck a lot because I just love it. This is the first <clears> time <throat> I've ever used this iteration of the deck. Yeah, it's really weird. Like I definitely, oh yeah, I'm I'm a huge proprietor of Bridget over Lily. <laughs> like uh, I hear a lot of arguments about that. Definitely think Bridget's Wait, better than what? Lily in this deck. I think Dude, Bridget's you're saying better. Lily. Yeah, Lily. Why? Because Bridget. Because here's the thing, right? Um. I actually do want to. I, do, I actually do want to say this, Bridget. Uh, you know how you have all these ball search cards to get you stuff. It's like, oh boy, I can get all these Pokemon really early game if I draw into them. The the problem with that is that throughout the game you don't have those options. If you choose to do them all early game to get a bunch of Inkes and a bunch of like like uh, GX Pokemon, you don't have the option later to discard second energies from your hand to thin your hand out to uh, get Lele's for game to get attackers for game. You're lo you're losing a bunch of options for mid to late game. Uh, search by choosing to play uh, Lily over Bridget. Yeah, I I mean I'm I definitely prefer Bridget like 100. Yeah. percent I prefer Bridget just because I mean it like Lily. It's like okay, I hope I get the setup that I would get from Bridget. What? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> then why aren't you running Bridget? <laughs> just play the Bridget. <laughs> yeah, but alrighty. Well, that is uh four games. You got an extra one for free because I just got absolutely bodied in the first one and actually somewhat made a game out of it in the second one. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed watching like comment, subscribe to, uh, my channel and my channel only just kidding. Or <laughs> bomb. Is, uh... Hey guys, everyone go uh, subscribe to the token minorities. <laughs> <laughs> There's also, more than just myself. So you don't have to listen to me. It's true. If you guys don't like uh, nasally voices, um, that's fair. <laughs> is your voice nasally? I don't think your voice is nasally. No, I think uh, it's just the headset. Maybe. No, I don't. It's I don't hear. I'm. I'm I was just making fun of you. I don't think you actually have a nasally voice at all. But uh, fair enough. <laughs> uh, I forgot what I was gonna say. But definitely like, comment, subscribe, all that good jazz. Uh, show my friends some love if you're coming from the Aura Bomb channel. Much appreciated. And yeah, I guess we'll see you guys next time. Peace. And I guess you can show some Aura Bomb love as well. Uh, see you guys. Why not? <laughs>